Unscrolled is a group exhibition that explores China's traditional aesthetics through the practices of 10 artists. It's an essential attempt to break with what is often referred to as a very sort of superficial representation of tradition. And when we think of Chinese tradition, everyone thinks of landscape paintings and everyone thinks of ink. And those are legitimately Chinese traditional aesthetics. But how do those aesthetics play out today? How can we understand tradition and its importance today through artistic practices that are very honestly engaging with tradition? And it reveals additional layers of meaning that might otherwise go unnoticed. We chose this particular work from Shubing as the title work to the exhibition because it's the first grand work that you see upon entering. And when you first come across it, you see it's a, a traditional landscape. But once you move beyond the surface and you move around it, the facade is opened up and you see that it's composed completely of debris, natural debris, local debris, materials from found objects and also recyclables that the artist has used to recreate this landscape without using any drawing or any painting. And the idea is really to move beyond that superficial representation and to find the relationship between the outer appearance and the inner context. Ai Weiwei is one of the most prolific artists in China today. He's definitely one of the most known contemporary artists outside of China. He moved to New York during the 80s and returned to China in the 90s. And at that time, he started collecting Chinese antiques. This particular work that we have in Unscrolled is 886 chairs, and those are all antique stools from the Qing Dynasty. They were quite often passed down from generation to generation. And around the 60s, there was a mass industrialization and they were replaced with plastic versions. Although they were a very pragmatic and a very common stool, they were quite symbolic. Ai Weiwei really looks at this, it's sort of the loss of the craftsmanship and also the disregard for something as important and fundamental as this traditional chair. The installation's been constructed the same way that these chairs have, so they're detachable, replaceable, there's no particular entrance or exit from the space. It's non-linear in the same sense that it is organic and it flows through history in sort of a cyclical nature. And Ai Weiwei applies all these sort of complex ideologies and complex philosophies to his work. So while it's a commentary on sort of loss of tradition or the loss of sense of loss of culture, it's also something that's quite symbolic to the historical culture of China. Jennifer Ma is a work that is really the embodiment of our exhibition. She's used over 700 live plants and inked them with China ink. In a traditional Chinese landscape, you would depict the four seasons. In Jennifer's work, we can really see the four seasons throughout the exhibition. So in the beginning, you have a completely inked black plant, and when people come back, they'll see the green shoots begin to grow, they'll see the flowers begin to bloom, and in the end, you've really seen a petrified landscape that evolves over time. This particular work is really focusing on the regrowth and renewal of Chinese tradition. Some traditions fail, some traditions won't survive, but others will adapt and others will grow throughout history and into the present and future. This work actually demonstrates that quite literally, and so we consider it the theme behind the exhibition. We're also looking at the the more traditional formats of hand scrolls and wall murals, as well as the materiality of ink on paper, and classical brushwork. And it's a very dynamic representation of tradition that breaks with what is usually equated with the traditional aesthetic of China. And it helps us to look at the transformations of tradition within a country of 5,000 years of history. 
unscrolled one of the inaugural exhibitions of the Vancouver Art Gallery's Institute of Asian Art. I hope visitors to the exhibition will explore the idea of tradition as a contemporary artistic language, one that engages with the wider developments in the 21st century, not only in China but also globally.